Hi everyone, hope everyone is doing fine today. Here is Abdul and today we have another unboxing and this time we have a um, sponsored video. And so as you can see, I have uh, a watch in front of me from a brand called About Vintage. They produce uh, several watches. Uh, they are designed in Denmark and like here you can read by Scove Anderson. They have really cool uh, watches in their collection and uh, we'll check out one of their watches now. First off, packaging well done. You don't see this uh, often that you find. Please always remember this crew in the crown in. That's very important for people who go swimming with their watches. Never forget to screw in your crown. Box looks really nice, wooden box. So let's take the wooden box out. Put this inside, put this on the side and voila. We have the 1982 GMT World Traveler. It's a quartz watch. 41 millimeters, but we'll go through the dimensions now. First, let me show you a little bit the watch. So you have here 24 hours bezel, which is a little bit fixed somehow, maybe it's plastic. You have a oyster, uh, sorry, a Jubilee style bracelet, extra links here. So five links bracelet you have milled clasp which i always like more than the uh, stamped clasp here is the number of the this reference the reference number is av192 41sf 2b2x1 1982 gmt steel dark blue off white five links so this is the number of the watch you get here also a two-year warranty so you have a two-year warranty here which is quite good for a micro brand and i also leave um code abdul r you get five percent extra on the 15 percent uh, which starts tomorrow i think from the 18th till 28th of uh, november you would be able to get 15% on the website and with my code you will get 5% more and uh, let's take the stickers off so here we have the first sticker let's take the stickers off the bracelet as well because I do think I will try to wear it with this bracelet and I'll make a video to compare it also with the Seiko GMT that I have so we'd be able to compare um, yeah uh, let's say a mechanical GMT to a this one is a quartz GMT so this is a quartz watch I'm just trying to get the stickers off let's take the last one yes we took the stickers off let's put this here so let me get the caliper so we have here we zero the caliper so it should be 41 in diameter like to like is around 47.5 according to them yeah 47.5 and thickness is around 12 millimeters so 11.75 it has a oh, let me check this out how big is the bracelet i think it's a 20 millimeters yeah it's a 20 millimeters bracelet let me be sure yeah it's a 20 millimeters bracelet so you have a 20 millimeters bracelet like i said you have a ronta 515 2h gmt quartz swiss movement uh domed sapphire crystal so really nice it's uh, scratch resistant sapphire and has an anti-reflect coating as well let me clean it up and let me put it on the wrist so i have a 17 centimeter wrist so as you can see this is the wash on my wrist it looks quite nice i have to take a little bit out of the bracelet and yeah 
let's move the hands around let's see how it's moving so we have a screw down crown as you can see 100 meters water resistance yeah you can change the gmt hand freely you can move them around so you can fix several times so let's say we fix the time at 12 and we fix oh, that's the, the date the gmt hand also to 12. And then we can move it around So today will be oh. that's pretty hard to set up but like i said this is one of the things that you have in this uh, movement that the gmt hand is let's say functions as another time so you can set up multiple times. Let me set this up again. Yeah, like I said, I uh, I will do a, a video review of this watch. Here's some stickers still. And I will try it out maybe with a couple of uh, bracelet options. Uh, here's the bezel. It's bi-directional, so both directions. So you can even set up multiple time zones, like I said. Anyways, if you have any questions about the swatch, write it down in the comment section. I left the details in the uh, description and also the code, the website, the link to the watch. Uh, we didn't see the case back. Here is the case back. And you can get even here your name or whatever you want to, in to get it engraved. You can get it engraved on the watch as well. Let me take the sticker off as well. So... And this is always an invitation to like, subscribe, and hit the bell button, and hopefully see you in the next one. Thanks, everyone, and see you in the next one. Bye-bye.